Korean model Ji Young Soon has spoken about the painful relationship that she shared with her husband Eli Kim, a former UKIS member, on Kang Ho Dong's show Rice Heart. The actress revealed that they pretended to be sharing a lovely relationship just for the TV while opening up on the struggles that she had gone through after they applied for divorce. There are a few more allegations she has made against the husband that has debt trapped her. Paying EMIs for hubby's loans. According to her Ji Yunsu, Eli had purchased a luxury car, but since her estranged husband shifted to the U.S., the responsibility of clearing debts in South Korea have fallen on her, a report on Korea Boo claims. She is now paying his EMIs from her hard-earned money and it will take another eight years to clear the debts. Mother-in-law escapes Ji Young Su's money. Another allegation the Korean model has made against Eli is about his mother escaping with her money. After their marriage, his mother wanted to settle in an apartment for which they had deposited money. His mother had then suggested his son change the deed to her name and assured him of not troubling them in any way. So, her husband did it without Ji Young Su's consent. Once they decided to leave Korea, his mother left without returning her share of the deposited money. The Korean model claims that she had not received the money, yet. These allegations have come as a surprise to many as people believed that her hubby belongs to a well-off family that has a three-story building in Virginia. On Rice Heart Show, Ji Young Soo had opened up on how her hubby informed his decision to divorce her after she had returned from the U.S. to Korea over visa issues. She was heartbroken and thought of taking her life out of depression. However, the model changed her mind as her mother might be shattered beyond words to see her daughter on the deathbed. She had also complained about not getting financial help from hubby and had thought about taking a legal route to solve the issue even though he is happily staying with their son in the U.S. The estranged couple tied the knot in 2017. The couple had an age difference of 11 years due to which their relationship had met with opposition. They filed for a divorce in November 2020.